day with me. And as you can see, we get up really, really early and it's still dark outside. So this is how every day started for 17 years. My little alley cat following me around, talking to me in the morning. I'm so glad I got all of this footage of her because she ended up passing away about four days after this. So super happy that I have this. So for breakfast on this day, I had a Go Macro bar and then I had coffee. Um, I just get the Starbucks cold brew coffee and it's in my Rise and Shine mug from Target. Um, I think this was part of their holiday collection last year. And the Go Macro bar that I was eating this day was one of their new ones. It's a blueberry almond or something. And this is the nutrition information in case you're wondering. So now I'm getting ready to wash my hair. So I'm brushing it. Um, I have a Tangle Teaser brush that I love and I actually need a new one. I've had it for a couple of years and it's getting kind of grody. So yep, getting ready for a shower. Gotta brush my teeth. And after my shower, I always read my Hope for Each Day by Billy Graham. I think I showed you guys this last time I did a Spend the Day with Me, but this is what I read every day of my life for the past maybe I don't know, five or six years, maybe seven years. Oh yeah, and then I recorded me stretching. Okay, so I stretch every single day. I feel like this is such a great way to start your day. It makes me feel really good. I have a sped up, by the way. I don't normally go this fast. <laughs> so yeah, um, but I just stretch and stretch and stretch and stretch basically. So whenever I'm watching this back, it kind of looks like I'm like exorcist or something <laughs> going on in this floor part. So this is kind of funny to watch back, particularly this part right here. So anyways, yeah, this is my stretching routine um, sped up really, really, really fast. Now I'm gonna put my makeup on and I am starting with my ELF primer for my eyelids. This is about three or four dollars and I love it just as much as I loved the Urban Decay one that I used to always use. So now I'm gonna use my Too Faced Chocolate Bonbons palette and I use that one for my highlight and that one for just my lid. Now I use this color with a liner brush and just line the tops of my eyelashes. Urban Decay Liner, I think the color is called Junkie. Now I'm gonna use my MAC Mascara. This is Extreme Dimensions and the color I like is Jim Dandy. It's kind of a purpley blue color. Now it's time for Cabral. Cabral is a product from Benefit that is awesome. It's kind of like a gel powder situation and it's just good for filling in anywhere that's kind of sparse on your brows and just kind of making them look a little bit more defined. I'll make sure to link all of these products below for you guys in case you're interested in just seeing what they look like or if you're interested in purchasing them. So now I'm gonna use my Pacifica perfume and then I'm gonna get dressed. And I was so proud that I did this. Ta-da! The shoes I'm wearing are my Sperry's. And then I went to Sprouts. And I remembered my reusable bags. Yay! I got tofurkey sandwich slices, I got hope hummus, and then I got some stuff for a salad that day. So I got olives from the olive bar. These were grilled Kalamata olives. I just got a spring mix. Um, I got some fish fillets, some follow your heart American cheese slices. I got some ravioli 
and um, a couple of things of yogurt, peach tea, strawberries, pre-cut pineapple, tomatoes, and I got some breakfast bars whenever my camera goes down. Yeah, I'm a bar person. I really like bars a lot, so got those. I got some of these brownie sandwich cookies, and oh my gosh, you guys, these are so good. I got some Brussels sprouts that are kind of shredded up, and those were really good. And then we still haven't tried this. Um, this is a rice situation that has lime in it. Okay, those Kashi chips are already gone. Those were amazing. If you ever see those, totally try them. They are so, so good. Um, they're like dangerously good. A little bit of time has passed and it is time for lunch. So Bella has this every day. She has one of these wellness meals and then these are all of her supplements that she has every day in her lunch. So this is not her medicine that she takes. She's on a couple of prescriptions as well, but these are just supplements that just kind of help support her. She takes a lot of cranberry stuff, milk thistle, um, and a few other things. And I mix all that with yogurt and I didn't show you because it looks gross. My lunch was a salad and I put some of the Brussels sprouts in there, um, tomatoes, those grilled olives that I'm really proud of right here. And then I put some um, Greek goddess dressing on it from Annie's and also I put some sunflower seeds too. And it was really, really yummy. And then I had some of these skinny pop popcorn mini cakes. Um, this is the sharp cheddar flavor, which happens to be vegan and it's awesome. I washed my strawberries and I actually soaked my strawberries in a mix of vinegar and water for about 10 minutes and it just gets all the crap off of there. And then I rinse them really well. And then I store them in the refrigerator, usually in a basket. I think I show you that later. So then I went outside and checked on my plants. Um, this is my little cactus. I don't know if it's a Christmas cactus or a Thanksgiving cactus. My granny gave me a piece of it to start like a couple years ago and she couldn't remember which one it was. And now I don't know. <laughs> this is my lemon tree. Um, you can see he's doing pretty good out here. I have him in front of the screen door so he can get a little bit more sun than, you know, than not. I still don't want him outside quite yet because I feel like he's too delicate and little and I don't want stuff on him like birds and whatever, I don't know, animals. This succulent, I don't know what kind it is, but it started out being tiny, 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 and I've had to repot that thing about probably six times and I've given pieces away. So if you want something that grows really easy, look for something like that. Oh, there's my strawberries in their basket in the refrigerator. So I find whenever I store fruit like that, I'll just eat it as I go through the day. Then I'm in a tea, and whenever I say made a tea, I mean I mix half water and half tea in my little sip tumbler, which I'll link the sip tumbler below if you guys are interested. I don't think they have the cactus one, but they have other colors, and this is really, really a great tumbler. It keeps everything cold for a super long time, and I love the lid. Then I took a few minutes to sit outside. Bella was gonna sit with me, and she changed her mind. Um, I think they sat in the floor. But anyway, I just sat out here and worked on a knitting project for a little bit and I love it out there. It's just so peaceful and the dogs love it and it's just amazing. So for dinner I had guardian wings, but I didn't use the sauce. I had quinoa, corn, black beans, and peppers mix and then a side of guacamole. This is what it looks like cooking. I was a little worried because it looked like it was kind of like runny, <laughs> but it cooked up fine. And these are the little wings cooking. I didn't use the sauce that it came with because I wanted to put my own on it. This is obviously not the best food presentation you've ever seen, but these are the sauces that I decided on. So I kind of mixed a little bit of both of these together and just dipped my wings in it as I went along. I love hot sauce and spicy things. We have a whole dedicated shelf to that in our refrigerator. All of those are hot sauces. If you want a dedicated sauce video <laughs> or what's in my fridge video, let me know and I'll film that for you guys. Um, anyways, after dinner, I took the puppies for a walk and Oscar likes to act a fool in the front yard. And yeah, 
that's just what he does. So then we went for a little walkie up the road. And Bella, yay. So Bella walks like a little angel on her leash. She's so slow. Um, but her harness is kind of a one piece step in harness. And I'll link that for you guys too, if you're interested in that. This would be good for like a little, you know, little prissy dainty dog who doesn't really, you know, act a fool. Oh, my poop bags. So I got bags for poop and they have emoji poops on it. I thought that was funny. Then we all watched TV. So I actually forgot I filmed this, but we were just sitting in the living room watching TV. Oscar always sits up there. Bella always sits beside me and Allie always sat right here in front of me while I knit and we watched TV. So I'm really glad I got this footage too. Cause like I said earlier, she passed away not long after this. And then I had a brownie sandwich cookie and you guys, I think I already said this, but these were amazing. So yummy. I would definitely repurchase. So this night, the puppies got um, three dog bakery cookies. She's so funny with that. That's what she does when she wants something. And then they had their mug water. They have a mug of water every single night before bed. This is a thing they do. Little Allie does get some, I promise. After that, we went to bed and I turned my diffuser on and I love this new diffuser. It has so many settings. You can control how much mist, you can control how long it stays on, a lot of different cool things. So I'll link it below for you guys. I think that's it for our day, so thank you for spending the day with us. I hope you guys enjoyed this, and I will see you next week with a new video. Bye, guys! Mm -hmm.